Okay, so I'm doing another MedNAF video. Uh, this time it's the Sega Mega Drive or Genesis, as it's also known in different regions. Uh, so if we tap on MedNAF to launch it, let's find our ROMs. And I've got a Mega Drive folder. So let's start with California Games. I used to really enjoy playing this one. Um, it's probably not the best game, but it was because it was BMX uh, at the time and skateboard and things like that. It was what I was into, and uh, so it's just really nice to to be able to play those games. It was one of the earliest ones that had it. So let's do practice because we can skip in and out of it. Now I can't. I don't really know the controls for the half pipe. I think it was down and up, and then there was like a whether it was. Uh, yeah, let's continue. Uh, I think it was down and up, and then maybe turn left or right when you get to the top of the quarter pipe. Let's see if I can get enough height. Yeah, it's definitely give me height. Oh yeah. Okay, didn't turn in time. I don't know if right is always the way to turn. Let's get another one with that. So up and down, oh, okay. So it looks like if you leave the top of the half pipe, then you have to turn. One more go. Oh yeah. And I don't know if I can do any tricks. Look at the height. Uh, what else have we got, foot bag? I quite like this. Uh, it's quite therapeutic because there's no stress. It's very relaxing. And uh, you can do this thing where look, we can flip it up. We can turn around. Come on, can you battle that? Right, let's do a little turn around, flip, turn around, shoulder. <laughs> Okay, you get the idea. Surfing, I like the surfing one. The surfing one works well. What was I saying, this wasn't a good game. It was a decent game. Now you gotta try and not do that. You gotta try and keep away from the break in the wave. But then also, it seems to be, I don't know if it's turning that makes you go faster. Yeah, it does seem to be that. But you also have to exit and enter at the same angle, which that wasn't. So you have to be the same degree angle when you exit and enter to keep it going. Let's get some speed and let's, let's see if we can do a, oh, nearly a whole 360. No, I might as well try another 360. Oh, you get, you get points for being in the barrel of the wave as well, I see. Oh yeah. Oh. Okay, that's the jump button. Oh, come on. Now we're motoring. Bit of a change of pace. I was just like flashbacks. It was quite a nice, relaxed game uh, to run, and the graphics always seemed really nice and the nice anima animation. And I think on this, the the gun seems to have unlimited ammo, whereas I seem to remember, unless it was another world, you used to have uh, a limit on the ammo, and you never had enough ammo. But it's kind of Prince of Persia with a gun in this sort of gameplay. Right, so. Yeah, again, I'll, I just like all these bits. It just adds to it. So I can pull a gun and I can shoot. But I can also, uh, I think it was that one, to, yeah, to jump across. And you can run as well. So if you see something that 
I'm not sure if I can get this guy. Doesn't look like it can, does it? So, let's go back. I might put my gun away just in case. Right, so, drop down. Oh, no, no, no. That wasn't going to go well, was it? So, is there stuff? There's something there, isn't there? So I can go up and I can hit, oh, down and A, yeah. So do I, do I run past this guy? Ah, there you go. Right, okay, so you obviously have to shoot him at, at the point that he's taller. Probably the same with the other robot. So what I'm going to do to this one. Got him? Yeah, of course I have. Uh, go on, jump up. Yes. Right, so do I shoot this guy or do I... He's got a gun. Doesn't look like there's anywhere else I can go. Hello, mate. Oh, no, obviously, right, he's not, he's not friendly. <laughs> How many, his gun's not very good though, is it? I was pressing the wrong button then. Can I pick anything up? Oh. Oh, so I can shoot him, and I can shoot the robot. Oh, yeah. Right, so I think that's pass. Pass, shoot. Pass, pass. Oh yeah. Okay, NHL 93. Uh, I used to play this, had this for the original Mega Drive and really liked it. Apparently the next version was better because you, you had like a, a quick shot mode, but this is the one I remember playing so I figured I'd play this one. Particularly good for its fighting element. I've got to work out, right, so B's pass, is it? B's pass. On the way I've configured it. That's shoot, right, okay. Yay! I can't remember what I'm doing. <laughs> Good to see the fighting back. That's what that's what I was playing on for. Okay, so Super Skid Marks was a very good game on the Amiga, uh, and that was where I used to play it most. Um, funny enough, it doesn't leave the skid marks behind in this version of the game, um, but I guess it's to do with the system having less power, and the graphics certainly aren't as good as the Amiga version, but it's really nice to see it running properly, uh, because it often has real graphical errors uh, on emulators. I've, I've really struggled to get this game to emulate well. Still in last place. I didn't think I was driving that bad. or oh, bounce. Uh, That was alright. No, I keep, keep clipping the edge. It is, it is a difficult game. But, uh, but definitely worth trying. Come on, let's not let it be last place. <laughs> it is going to be last, isn't it? Yeah, okay, last place. Anyway, I hope you like those. Uh, I'm going to cover more systems on Mednaf. Uh, but thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe.